Are you getting the unsupported video driver error when trying to start Premiere Pro? Then you're not alone. And in this video, I will show you a couple of ways you can fix this problem. The first solution is to open the device manager. And here you should be able to see the same name as you can see in the error message. So go ahead and right click on that one and then click on update driver. Now click on search automatically for drivers. And you can see here in my case that the GPU is already up to date. However, if you're yours is not, then I recommend updating it, and then you can try to start Premiere Pro. If yours is up to date, like mine, then I will show you how to manually update your drivers. To do this, open your favorite web browser, and now you want to search for the name of your GPU, and that will be the name you can see in the error message as well. In my case, that's NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1650. And after the name, you want to type driver and then hit search. Here, I'm going to open this first result. Make sure to not click on a add. And if you have an Intel or a AMD GPU, this will be pretty much the same. Simply Google the name, type driver, and then open the first result. Now we want to fill in these details about our graphics card. So in my case it's GeForce GTX 16 series. And here I can see the name of my GPU, Windows 10 64 bit. And under the download type you want to choose the studio driver since we are video editors. And then click on search. Now I'm simply going to download the newest version here. And then I will click on download again. And now we will just have to wait for it to download and there it's finished. By default you will find it in the downloads folder. Go ahead and double click it, click on OK and wait for this to finish. Once it's finished you just have to wait a little bit. Still waiting. Agree and continue. I will just go with the recommended option here and then it's starting to install the new driver. Which may take a while. Ooh, okay, it's finished. They ask if you want to launch the GeForce experience or create a desktop shortcut. I will not do this and I will click on close. And now you can try to start Premiere Pro and hopefully your video driver is supported. According to the internet, if you rely on an integrated GPU on an Intel processor from the fifth generation or older, then Intel does not update these drivers, and in that case you might not be able to solve this error. However, according to one guy in the Adobe community, he was able to use Premiere Pro even though he had the error. And he simply turned off the error by going to Edit, Preferences, general and then unchecked this show system compatibility issues at startup and had clicked ok. So I don't know if this will work for you but I guess it's worth giving it a chance at least. If you started getting this error after updating Premiere Pro then going back to the previous working version may be worth a shot. So to do this you want to open the creative cloud application then click on all apps and here on the right side of Premiere Pro, click on these three dots, click on other versions, and then install the version you had when you did not get the error. For more solutions to this error, check out this article here I have written on my website, where you will find some additional solutions to try. I will leave a link to it in the description, and give the video a thumbs up if you found it helpful.